Hi, so I want to show you some of the issues I'm having with the Arlo app. If I click on the Arlo app, then you can see at the moment my home is disarmed. I can change that from armed, no worries at all. I can change that to scheduling. Uh, I've got a special night mode which I schedule um, only at night. So when I get home, I want it to automatically switch to that. So naturally, I want to use geofencing. So I'll choose a random address because I'm obviously posting this online. Um, it doesn't matter if I change it small, medium, large, let's just go medium. Um, and click next, I say home, I say armed. I don't want disarmed, it doesn't matter, the same error will occur. I do want schedule. Um, and then there's my phone, so I click next. And do the summary there, I click save. Then finish. And what you'll see is, it recognizes I've left but it'll automatically switch back to whatever I'd previously armed it to. Um, so that's concerning. Um, it doesn't stay on there. I cannot, cannot get geofencing to work. I've seen this really weird message that occurs. Let's just go pick a random address again. Um, and I can go armed, schedule. If I, at this point here, deselect my phone, I can actually save, so I have zero enabled devices. Um, and geofencing will stay on, but obviously there's no devices in there. And if I go back um, and try to make my iPhone enabled, it'll disappear. Now, if I'm really quick, I can actually <laughs> like do the click, click. I can actually get it back on, and this is what happens. I click save, and geofencing location not found for your account. And in fact, I'm pretty much stuck here at this point. So I don't know what to do. I don't know why my phone isn't showing up. I've changed all the settings. I've allowed access to my location. I've got other apps which you can see. Um, I've, I've found a workaround um, with if then, uh, if this then that. Um, and I, I think I'll continue just describing my workaround in case anyone else um, is experiencing the same problems. Um, but the workaround's not perfect. So I can use if this then that um, to if I enter an area disarm Arlo if I exit an area arm Arlo there's two problems with this um, when my wife leaves um, before me then when she exits obviously that's going to arm Arlo but I'm still at home so we can't have that I've actually found a fix for that issue if arm Arlo when everyone in your life 360 circle leaves so I found this app called life 360 circle and it, you can add users to it just like you would, I guess, to the Arlo enabled devices. And then it's got a first in, last out, I, I guess, setting. So it'll arm when the, and so you can set it to arm when the first person gets home and you can set it to, oh, sorry, disarm when the first person gets home. That's this app here. Um, but then arm um, um, when the last person leaves, which is useful. However, it's still not perfect because I can't set my specific scheduling mode, so I still have to manually do that because if I try to add a, um, if I try to add, let's just do the normal one. So like, for example, I enter an area, and let's just select there next. Um, and if I try to choose an action, I've either got arm, disarm, or start recording. I don't have any option to choose my schedule. So that's the limitations of this workaround, but I guess it still enables me to do some things. Um, so your help would be appreciated. I'd like to know why my phone is not finding uh, the geofencing location, but then it is, like it still knows where I am, so that's weird. And if you can help me, that would be great.